Hi, what's your MLD? A lot of organisations I work with ask that question, they don't have a clue what I'm talking about, where it came from. 20 years ago I worked for Coca-Cola. I'd just been in to see a big national account about a big Christmas promotion that we're doing. Merchandising, whether we're getting the holidays are coming, the lorry. I'd actually been out for the day with my boss. And as we got back into my car after seeing a client, my boss turned to me and said, what's your MLD? I had to ask him what it meant, and, all the, and what he actually did, he replied, what could you have done more of, what could you have done less of, and if you had to do that call again next week, what are you going to do differently? The first two questions focused on what just happened, the third question focused on what would happen next week, in an ideal world. Now he coached me through that, and that's what I would say coaching is, asking me what I think. Feedback, he could easily use MLD. What I think you could have done more of, what I think you could have done less of, what I think you could have do differently is that. And it's push rather than pull. But he used it as a coaching model. I still use this to this day, 25 years old, when I run a workshop or whether I speak at an event or whether I'm coaching somebody or whether I'm putting this video together, I'll self-evaluate and ask myself, what could I have done more of, less of, differently? Maybe you could try it with your team or try it with yourself. What could you do more of, less of, differently? Good luck with it. I hope you try it. I'd love to you know, give me some feedback. Let me know. Does it work for you? Does it not work for you? What actually happens? But just give it a go anyway. Just try it. What's your MLD? All the best.